All right, today we'll be doing Substance Painter to Unreal and Unity. This will be a very easy tutorial and very informative. All right, here's the model we're working on today. I modeled this myself and textured myself. Yes, thank you, thank you. All right, let's get to exporting some textures. All right, to get started, let's do Unreal Textures. So File, Export Textures. I'm gonna choose my location for output. Let's go to the output template and we're going to pick Unreal Engine for Pact. Everything else looks good. Let's change the resolution to 4K and export. Doot, 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 doot. And it is done. All right, let's import the model. Boop, 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 boop. Importing model. Let's do this as static import. You'll notice that the model doesn't look quite right. I'm not sure what's wrong. Um, we're going to scale it up and you'll see what I'm talking about. But this comes okay in Unity. But it doesn't matter because this is a painter tutorial, not a model importing tutorial. Boom, there it is. Let's open the text, or sorry, let's open the material. Let's import the textures. Boom, Unreal. Grab all three of them, drop them in. First things first, let's open up the Occlusion Metalness Roughness and uncheck sRGB because this is a linear file, not an sRGB file. All right, let's delete this color. Delete it. Drop in the diffuse. Let's connect it to base color. Bring in the normal. Connect that to normal. Boom. All right, now for this last map, it's a little bit different than the rest because we have to separate the channels. If we take a look at it, we'll see that it's occlusion, roughness, and metallic. So the occlusion is first and the R. Dump that in occlusion. Roughness is next. Dump that in. And then now it's metalness for blue. Boom. Save it. One thing to note, let's take a look at the base texture. We'll see it says color. The normal, it says normal. The triple texture is linear color. Here it is. We brought in our first texture from Substance Painter. Well, correctly. I'm so proud of you. Look at it. It's amazing. Ah, oh, fantastic. All right, now on to Unity. All right, same story, different characters. Let's go to File, Export Textures. We're going to change the output to... We're changing this to Unity Universal Render Pipeline. Let's hit Export. do 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 boop And done. Uh, let's go to Unity. All right, let's import the model. Right-click Import, find the model, import it. Let's drag it in, scale it up a little bit, and take a look at it. As you can see, it looks just fine, which is curious to me. Oh well, I'll figure that out later. Let's import the textures. Boom, 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 here it is, import. All right, let's create a material and then link those textures up. Renaming, do, 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 cool, let's open it up. All right, let's plug those textures in. So let's grab the diffuse first, drop in albedo, grab the metalness, bring in the metal, bring in the normal into normal. Let's make sure we hit this button fix now because it's a normal map. Let's drag that material on. Yes, look at that, beautiful. I think my lighting in the scene is making it look a little weird, but that's okay. Let's open up another scene and take a look at it. It looks cool in here. I'm digging it. Open that new scene. Do, do, do. Drag it in. Drag the material on it. Let's zoom on in. Take a look at it. It looks perfect. Fantastic. Another amazing tutorial. Congratulations, everyone. You guys did it. That's it for this tutorial. Thank you again, and uh, I'll be back soon.